Hey mamas, welcome to Black Mamas Do Science. This is a YouTube channel that I do with my son and we are exploring all the fun science experiments you can think of. We have a really cool, super quick, no more than 10 minutes science experiment for you today. We are going to be doing the magic spoon experiment. So if you don't know what we're talking about, don't worry, we're going to explore it together. All right, mamas, the ingredients, materials that you need for this experiment are pretty easy. Probably already have a lot of these things at your house. You'll need a small bowl. I decided to use a small clear bowl for this experiment. Then you will need pla a plastic spoon. I used two different color plastic spoons because, you know, why not? It's a science experiment, try it out. Then you will need a teaspoon of salt and a teaspoon of pepper. So get your measuring spoons out if you don't have those. And then you will need a dish towel. So any kind of dish towel you have in your kitchen or just a regular towel, you will also need that. I also recommend that you go ahead and put something down on your floor in case your kid is like that and he likes to spill, you know, materials all over the place. So definitely get something for your floor and for the table. So now that we have all of our ingredients, go ahead, sit down with your kids and you will first put one teaspoon of salt in that small bowl and a teaspoon of pepper. You can mix it up with your hand or what, however you wanna mix it up. Then you will need to use your plastic spoon. So with your plastic spoon, what you will do is you will rub it on the towel all around the uh, outside and inside of the spoon for 10 seconds. Once you do that, what you will do is you will hold the spoon over your mixture of salt and pepper. Now, this is the cool part. What you'll see is the pepper will start to be attracted to our spoon. It's magically picking up all the pepper and not the salt in our mixture. So that's why I thought it was pretty cool. I tried it out with a black spoon and a white spoon. You can see it a little bit better on our white spoon, but try it out a whole bunch of different ways you can i mean we did this experiment like maybe six or seven times because dax really enjoyed it so that is our magic spoon experiment and we will get into the science behind this now all right mama if this is your first time visiting black moms do science thank you so much and we are excited that you're here don't forget to like and subscribe below so you can keep up with all of our fun science experiments. Okay, moments, you have made it to the science behind our magic spoon experiment. So I bet you're wondering why the pepper was pulled up to our spoon instead of the salt. I'm going to explain it. So when the spoon is rubbed against the dishcloth, electrons are transferred between those two materials and that is causing a charge imbalance that creates static electricity you know static electricity when the spoon is charged it can attract small objects like the pepper you noticed that our salt stayed in the bowl and the pepper was pulled up and that is because pepper is lighter than the salt eventually if you create a strong enough charge rub it on the towel even longer it should pull up the salt also but it'll pull up the pepper first so that is the science behind our magic spoon experiment we hope you've had a lot of fun doing it dax liked it he also liked dumping all the salt and pepper on the floor but you know you win some you lose some so we hope to see you next time bye y'all